But what you said earlier was that there's a couple attendees, listeners, that have mentioned to you that it has completely changed their lives and changed the practice of medicine. Mm -hmm. And you also went on to say that there's probably hundreds of thousands of patients that also go back to their physicians and say, you've changed my life. You've changed how I feel, how I function. I'm losing weight. I feel great. I got great energy. I got great sex drive performance, um, which is the icing on the cake, but they feel and function so much better. And patients come to me and go to their doctors, which is why all the doctors come back and con contact me and say, you have no idea how many doctors' lives and practices you've changed, yeah. but you also do not know and realize the hundreds of thousands of patients that you've benefited and that have a significant improved quality of life and health. You have no idea how many lives that you've changed. Well, I don't do this to, to, to accomplish that. I do it because... I'm so passionate about this is the science and the literature. <laughs> right. What is it that we don't understand about this? But the results that we get and the patient's lives that we've changed and the doctor's practices and lives that we've changed is unsurpassed. There is no drug that does that. There's no statin that does that. There's there's no there's no cardiovascular disease patient that comes back to the doctor and say, Wow, thank you, doctor. You've changed my life with your statin and my blood and my beta. Right. Blood. I've never heard that. That's <laughs> I mean it's a great point. I've exactly. never heard somebody say that. Thank you for putting me on that statin. I feel so much better. Yeah. And no beta blocker, my God, I feel so much tremendously better. <laughs> right. All the patients come to us and say we got to get off these medicines. We feel like crap on them. Right. We right. feel like crap. They're not doing anything. Oh, you got to take it. You got to hang in there. Yeah, you know, no, you don't got to hang in there. All the doctors want to take all the patients want to go off of the drugs because they don't feel well on them and we can, they can go off of them because if they're on the hormones, they won't need the drugs because their ApoB is so low, <laughs> so yeah. low and yet they feel tremendously better. 